Hello everybody and welcome back to Pokemon Black. In the last one, we went through the cold storage, we beat up Team Plasma, and unfortunately Clay did, did give them back their members. So today, we are going to head through the gym. Now I'm, I'm, I'm trying something a bit different for this recording. I wanted to use the actual mic I paid for, because even though it's plugged in, it doesn't let me use it because my headphones have a little mic because it's, you know, headphones for a phone. So, it keeps picking up the mic on there instead of my the Razer one that I paid for. So, I unplugged it and then muted the, the soundtrack for this so it wouldn't bleed over and, like, duplicate. So, I can't hear any of this, but I did test it. And you can still hear the audio, off, like, during the recording. But I just have it muted on my side. Where am I going? <laughs> oh yeah, um, let me check. Yeah, this should be fine. Maybe I'll leave with Kai. Let's leave with Kai. Let's see what happens here. Leave with Kai. Use a little, little for the battle. That should be fine. Noticing, um, sorry if the game looks a little laggy. <laughs> I feel like the further we get in, uh, the more lag it is. All right. What do you have? I'm sure it was tough dealing with all that right after you arrived here. For now, I'll, I'll give you this. Fresh water. Souvenir item. The gym leader Clay uses ground type Pokemon. Well, just between you and me, ground type Pokemon aren't good against water attacks. Kind of makes me wonder why Clay's living next to the water. <laughs> That's a good point right there. Alright, so I believe if we press... Yep. Also, failed to mention, ground types aren't good against grass or ice, but I don't know why I use an ice type. Alright, first battle down here. Alright, trainer, bring it on! <laughs> I will try. I need to get some good headphones that don't have a mic, that way I can hear what everyone else is hearing. Because I'm- I feel like I'm just like... Oh, his name is Felix, okay. A Palpitoad. Good thing I gave Kai Grass Knot! Let me grab one of my babies. Me and- me and my boy have like a collection of Squishmallows that we kind of rotate, like divorce- uh, like divorce uh, couples. And we call them our children. So I have- we have like two frogs, a strawberry, and then like a- a jelly one. And we don't use the names that were given, you know? So, I believe the strawberry's name is Shortcake. And the, the green frog's name is, um, fuck, what's his name? You always forget about the oldest one. Um, Chonko, that's it. I don't think we came up with names for the yellow frog and the jam, so. They're unnamed babies right now. All right, this should kill it. If not, I'll be disappointed in you, Kai. You, you are not disappointed. <laughs> All right, level 31 for Kai. Good job, boy. And look at those stats. And Wilbur. Wilbur's such a good Pokemon. I got so excited, because I was at, um... Was it work yesterday? Oh, well, no, I wasn't excited yesterday. I got excited on Saturday because I got a notification on my YouTube showing that Chaga Conroy uploaded a video uh, stating that he's going to do Pokemon, um, Pokemon Black and White 2. And I got super excited because that's my favorite game right there. But, but, um, yesterday was awful. <laughs> I had our closing lady called out so I couldn't I had to do the poll list and then this must have happened while I was off like it wasn't there when I was on my lunch because I went to my car on my lunch so this must have happened after my lunch which I guess was in between like one and then when I got off some idiot decided to I'm so pissed about it. This this idiot 
like, I walked up to my car, and someone put their cart, like, right on my bumper. And I was like, oh, did they just place it there? But, I'm like, no. They left the big-ass scratch on my side. And unfortunately, our cameras don't reach that far. So, and I don't know who the hell did it. And then I got in the car all pissed, because I, I just had a, a, a pretty shit day at work. And then someone scratched the crap out of my car in the back. And then I get up and I see a piece of paper on the- on my- like, someone stuck it underneath my windshield. So I was like, oh, maybe someone- when the person that accidentally hit my thing, maybe they left a note or something. Um, no. It was someone saying that my car was dirty and that they can power wash it for me. So, now I had a big ass scratch and someone called my <laughs> car dirty. <laughs> Oh, I was so pissed. <laughs> You're like, we come to you, only fifty dollars. And I'm like, no. <laughs> Why would you do that? <laughs> and that wasn't there during my lunch. So in the span of me getting off a of lunch and then leaving of work, someone hit my car with a cart and then put a note saying that my car's dirty. I don't know if it's the same person. I hope not. <laughs> so, kind of mad about that one. <laughs> Where do I gotta go again? Wait, I gotta get. Down. Oh, I forgot you can walk on these. Uh, there it is. Uh, yes. So, that was an unnecessary battle I did. I face my Pokemon and we share our f real feelings. Sometimes that's what I do in here in this gym. That's great. <laughs> I have so much things I have to pack. I feel like I got most of my stuff in boxes. And now, like, I'm looking around and it seemed pretty empty. I got boxes everywhere full of stuff. And I'm like, oh, I still have all that and all this. <laughs> So it's not getting better. I keep buying stuff. <laughs> Especially, um, on my- you'll probably see it on my recent video of, uh, the Wattpad Book Club, but I, um, <laughs> I changed my profile on Discord from my little phoenix icon that I used for my channel to Sanji, and it wasn't even because we were reading One Piece fanfiction. It was just because I'm a simp. <laughs> and now I have like three figures. <laughs> like one of them was like a miniature one I got at Five Below. And I have like all the other ones. So I have like... I, not all of them. I, I don't have Nami, Robin, and Usopp. So I have the little Sanji one. Which only... <laughs> I'll tell that story in a second. So I have that one. And then I have the... When I got a GameStop, it was apparently they had the Monster Trio there, and apparently his was the cheapest. So I don't know how to feel about that. And then, oh, we're here already. Oh, not yet. I don't know why his was the cheapest out of all the the Monster Trio. Quite at the bottom of the gym, but I will test you to see whether you are skilled enough to face the gym leader. And then I went to GameStop a second time. And they had this other figure. I've never seen Sanji in this outfit before. Uh, it, be, it do be looking good though. I just never seen it. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm get. If I had to guess the arc it's from, it's probably uh, Punk Hazard. But anyway, um, so I believe it was Tuesday. Um, I went out with Coda. And we cosplayed in public, which it was a fantastic time. So, I, uh, they cosplayed Sora from Kingdom Hearts, and then I cosplayed Sanji from One Piece. And I, I, I pulled it off so well, it looks scary. I think I put a picture of it in my community tab if you guys want to look at it. And also on my Instagram, which I believe is just PhoenixFlayer69. So, I, it, it was scary how, like, I didn't even look at myself at all. So, Oh, he's level- he's got a lot of shit. Oh, Kai's dying. So we- we got Crumble Cookie, which was our original plan, and then we got- we went to Target, because I had to get flip-flops for Luffy, because I was gonna do Luffy the next day. And then we went to Five Below, 
and at Five Below, we walked in, I guess someone immediately recognized that I was, um, shit, no, I can't remember the, the, that I was Sanji. So, we went, like, while, we were, while I was looking at the Squishmallows, this lady runs up and she's like, Oh, excuse me, I have to give this to you! And she hands me the Sanji- shit, I can't- she, she hands me the little Sanji figure, which was why I went into, um, <laughs> went to Five Below in the first place. So, like, I immediately was like, oh my god, thank you, and then, like, I found the rest. And that's when I got, like, the Zora, Luffy, Chopper, and Brook. No, I got Brook at a different location. But, I loved them. <laughs> so, yeah, the Sanji figure started off with that little one, and then we went to GameStop, and I saw the <laughs> the, the one in the case, and I was like, Koda, I got to. And she's like, do it, man. If it makes you happy, I'm like, it would make me very happy. So, yeah, I got it. And then I, and we got a compliment from it. Like, <laughs> Like, as dressed up as Sanji, I was like, oh, excuse me, can I get a figure from the case? And they're like, oh, yeah, sure, which one? And you're like, can I get the Sanji one? And he's like, yeah, I guess I didn't expect anything else. <laughs> that the, the guy cosplaying Sanji would want the Sanji figure. I loved it. He, came in his, he put it in his like, the little box and everything. And now he's sitting prettily on my, my little <laughs> dash. And then we went back the next day, I was Luffy. I was- I was tempted to get the- the Luffy in the case, but they had a different Luffy and a, another Sanji one, so I bought two figures instead of buying one figure, and it was actually cheaper than buying the one figure. Because <laughs> I believe the Luffy one in the- in the case was six nine sixty nine ninety nine, So, a little hefty. And I believe I bought a Luffy one and a Sanji one, and they were 55. Oh, anyway, Kai Kai. <laughs> I can't hear any of the music, but it's okay, I'll, I'll listen to it post. Well, think, think about time to see for yourself if you- Think it about time to see for yourself if it is about your skills that made a gym leader like Elisa take such a shine to you. I struggle with reading. <laughs> That's why I like doing the Wattpad stuff. It makes me feel like I can read. Alright, what what does this guy got? Uh, Leader Clay. I believe it's a Palpatode, Krakara, and his ace is an extra drill. I called it. I'm so good at this. Alright. Little Little it will be next. She's a setup queen. I don't think we can paralyze this thing. I think we can. It's a grass move. And we're gonna set by crazy and sweep. And that's how you win. Damn, I wish I got pedagol in my um my nuzlocke. That'd be cool. Alright, so let's see if so we can get some HP and drain it. And then we'll set up quiver dances and then mega drain. Not very effective, but our speed fucking tanked. But it's okay, Quiver Dance will give us speed back, plus attack and defense. I'll be. Sure don't see that coming. Alright, let's see. Quiver Dance. I'm happy. I'm happy to see my husband. <laughs> yeah, so I think for my birthday, I, I think I'm just- I'm gonna have to update my list, because at the beginning of my boy's relationship, I gave him this list of things that I like, if he ever wanted to just, like, get me something nice or doesn't know what to get me for an occasion. I gave him a list of things that I like, so... He knows what to get me, you know? So it's not like he's guessing. So, I might need to update that list to put some, uh, other stuff on there. <laughs> what do you want? Do you think two will be enough? I'm happy. I'm happy to see my husband. I'm happy. I kind of want more Sanji figures, to be honest. Oh, oh shit! Our attack went up, but we're we're confused. No, not cool, Mr. Alligator. 
I don't know why I call him an alligator. He's clearly a crocodile. <laughs> oh yeah, we're confused. I don't know how good Lilligan's attack is, even with it being plus two. So. Alright, that should be fine. We did it three times. Now we'll use Giga Drain. Bro, oh, stop. Lilligan doesn't like that. You're gonna knock over her flower crown! <laughs> I'm sad I put Lilligan in the box. <laughs> My little plush of her. <laughs> Please don't, don't hit her. Okay. Alright, Croc's down. I might do <laughs> the same strat. Look at that, Logan's level 31. She deserves it. I could- wow, bringing out the ace already. I was not <laughs> ready. Um, stun spore. Paralyze it. See, Logan is fine. <laughs> Paralyze it. Why did I do so much? I thought I had, like... Oh yeah, I guess it is. It's defense, not special defense. Alright. Give me a drain. Damn! Look at that! I don't think I've ever one shot of this thing in my life. Two thousand... Good job for Lulligan! Lulligan's slain out here. And last but not least, Palpito, which I believe we just kick a drain <laughs> to be done. Giving up on the- Giving up is the easy way out. If I wanted to, I- Shit, okay. It's fine. We didn't need to read it anyway. <laughs> this fight's over. Unless it somehow survives, which I just- I would just be dumbfounded. Alright. A critical hit, that was a little bit over. <laughs> I believe we used three. Good on Lulu. Look at her. Well, I've had enough. And just so you know, I didn't go easy on you. Dude, I swept. I've never swept clay before. Ever. <laughs> well, I see. I ain't sure don't like it. For such a young... For such a young and you'd have an imposing battle style. I know you got people who got digging your potential. Huh. Here, take this. We got the badge! Look at us, we're, we're 16. I'm gonna open this now. In celebration. I found a, a sun kiss in the free, in the refrigerator and I was like, fuck you. Yeah. Look at that. Fifth badge. Eat it. So this is your fifth badge, huh? And if that's so... Oh, come on up to level 60, we'll obey you. Also, I'm giving you this TM. Well, that was the plan, but I just remember something I wanted. Wait in front of the cave at the Route 6, would you not? Would you? Oh. Alright. So he won't give it to us yet. So we gotta go, which I believe we get our fifth party member. I don't know why we're walking up the stairs so fucking... Took forever. I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm happy. Woohoo! <laughs> I can't believe we swept. We haven't touched Route Route Six at all. She was nice enough to remove the cone for us. Thank you. Appreciate that. All right. I'm so excited. We we'll get our our fifth uh, party member in the next episode, I believe. So we'll just use this episode to get over and battle the trainers. And uh, oh shit. I'll see how far I can get on this route before I, the, the video has to end. Hope you didn't hear me move the mic. It was just a little in the way. Let's see, let's see, let's see. I need to heal. And we'll put uh, Swoob out in the front, because I believe Bianca stops us before we even get to Route 6 to battle, so... A little bit of everything in this episode. We get the Bianca. Alright. 
I know. Lily Quinn did so well. I love her. She's my favorite. Her design's great. She's so easy to sweep shit. <laughs> Just paralyze. Leech seed it so you can get some HP back if it does hit you. And then just just stack quiver dances and then Giga Drain with a big root. It it's so easy. Um oh yeah, so Cosmo. I know you didn't get a lot of action, honey, but here you go. <laughs> I have some potential nicknames picked out. At, at least for Lil the uh, Litwick. Cause it's a fire type. And what what do you do with fire? You cook with fire. So I'm thinking if it's a boy, I'm gonna name it Sanji. I'm not. I'm not. I'm such a simp. <laughs> yeah, guess what? Guess what? Did you beat the gym? I find that hard to believe, but. <laughs> Hi Bianca. Hey, bring out the gym just now? Oh hey, that's your Phil's gym badge. Oh that's so cool. That's amazing. Yeah, what's up, girl? No, no, no. I can't get distracted being all impressed by your shiny new badge. I'm also a trainer. At times like this, you battle, right? Alright. Battle with Bianca. What does she have again? <laughs> she has four, just like me. I love her little animation trying to find her Pokeball. Alright, her dear. Oh, little little dog. Cosmo should be fine on this one. Oh, it's a girl! You know what this means? Uh, Cosmo gets intimidated by girls. Don't don't worry about it. Um, you're gonna use attract. Should we set up combines to increase our special attack and sweep? Oh, Cosmo. That would be such an ego boost for Cosmo. We should do that for him. He died. <laughs> Critical hit! Well. <laughs> well, shit. Alright, Jasper, it's your turn. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Rock Tomb. That was a critical hit. We're not strong. Speed fell, that's good. Now I was using Workup. I, I still can't believe I hit it at it. I had a tract on it. And that thing just went right through the attract. I can't believe it. I hope I can take that. I'm sure, well, probably. <laughs> You don't know? You're just turning your Pokemon? Alright, crunch it. Munch, munch, crunch. As I always say. No, oh, my children are rolling away from me. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Here, here's that. I was trying to get a blanket. It's actually kind of cold in here. I say is it's 75 degrees in here. <laughs> I don't know why. I feel like I'm just more sensitive to the cold. I don't know. Pan Sage. I forgot it has this thing. And unfortunately, my, my Cosmo's down right now, so I'll just crunch you and call it a day. Why didn't you evolve this thing? There was a guy that gave out stones for free for answering a question. Oh, we're sweeping with Jasper. With Jasper's Moxie? Hell yes, we are. Well, um, speaking of which, Jasper's level 31 now. Good on Jasper. Oh, Pig Knight! You are not gonna live through this one, buddy. I'm sorry. Like, I have one on my Nuzlocke, and what I know is that P9 has a lot of weaknesses. <laughs> ah, shit. <laughs> Why the fuck did that do so much damage? Oh, man. It didn't do anything. Well, Jasper's dying. Should I try again? Should I just crunch it? It's probably easier if I crunch it. Look at that. What? 
Well, we both died. What? It mm. All right, Kai. Go glare at it. And you'll probably fall over. <laughs> All right, let's see, let's see. I guess just Fury Cutter. Literally any damage will do. Shh. Forgot to use potions. Alright, let's try again. Um, Razor Shell. I should kill it right there. Yes, let's go. And Musharna. Musharna's so pretty. Oh, it's grass. Don't tell them! Alright, let's just spam Fury Cutter. That should work. I forgot what item I have Kai holding. Mm. We'll find out. Hypnosis! Reminds me of Django from One Piece. Alright, let's just spam Fury Cutter until Kai wakes up. That should be fine. And then... I think we can heal and maybe have one more trainer battle and then we have to end the episode. Come on. Oh. Kai, stop being asleep. They was using the Lilligan strategy. Give them a status and then <laughs> just spam like moves. Like like stat moves. Lucky chant, what the fuck does that do? Oh I'm happy. Happy. Happy happy happy. Yeah, even with all those defense curls, I can still make my attacks increase by spamming this move. Um, this is kind of bad, right? For you, it is. I'm I'm doing fine. I'm not sweating at all. I'm actually pretty cold right now. <laughs> Please, I need this thing to die so I can. So close. Ugh. She's gonna use another fucking potion. I can feel it. Yeah! I've used Fury Cutter so much. Come on. I used Fury Cutter so much. It's gotta do a little bit more than... than half. Come on. I don't know how Fury Cutter works. I know it just says the more you use it, the more damage it'll do, using consecutive. But I don't know if there's like a cap on the amount of damage it'll do. I hope this crits you and you die. <laughs> this should guarantee kill, right? Because it increases every time you use it. What? I feel Why did that do less? <laughs> Stop using the fence curl. <laughs> I don't have any way of dealing with psychics yet. I s well, I guess I guess I do have Jasper, the the dark type, ground type, you know. But she's dead right now, so finally, get out of here, Musharna. You're really pretty though, and Kai deserves that. Thank you. Oh, I lost. $5,000, that's so much money. Where did you get this money, Bianca? Are you holding out on me right now? I haven't had a Pokemon battle with you in a while, Phoenix. You've come so strong. I'm not that strong, so I don't know how to say it, but I think you're... I think you are...
way tuned into how your Pokemon feel. Oh, I know. I'll share this AHM with you. We got the age of our life. <laughs> we probably will get rid of a tract for that. <laughs> My pocket gave it to me after you tried to make me go home that time. I'm sure it will come home. Like, come home anytime he wants, though. But hey, I'll share this with Sharon, too. See you, Phoenix. Bye bye. Alright, let's see. Let's go heal my Pokemon real quick, and then we'll at least make some headway. So we're starting in the route. I'm gonna go a bit longer, but... It's okay, it's okay. Why is my game lagging so much? It would never do this on the DS. <laughs> Maybe I have too much shit open on my computer and it's like trying its best to keep up with me. <laughs> Alright, thank you for waiting. Thank you. Bye bye. Alright, to Route 6. To make some form of headway. Now, I believe we, even though we do have the TM, the, yeah, the HM for fly. I don't think we can use it yet until we get, like, a gym badge for it, I think. I don't know. I might be wrong about that. Who knows? But we can just give it to Cosmos so she can learn that in battle. Let's see. Here. Oh, battle this guy right here. Sub-scientist. Hmm. You're an intelligent case. Oh, interesting case. Please help me with my experiment. What's your experiment? <laughs> the Deerling? Because Deerling's pretty cool. Deerling is a pretty good Pokemon. <laughs> I kinda w I hope I get one in my in my Nuzlocke for me to use. I think it's only in Route 6 that you can get a Deerling. And they have like the different like forms based on what weather it is. And the Sawsbuck forms look super cool. I like fall. Falls is a real pretty one, and so is Summer. Let's see, let's see... Uh, just, uh, just air, air cut. Since it is a grass type. Alright, air cutter. That should work. I did not kill it. His heart stamp. Yay, it's dead. We just killed Bambi right there. Mm-hmm. It's difficult to get a result with this method. Anyway. <laughs> oh, there's a dream right here. Pokemon with dry skin love water type moves in rainy weather. I'm talking about the ability of these Pokemon, of course. Oh, yeah, that's right. Give them what they heal. Pretty good thing to remember if you do have a Pokemon with dry skin. Oh, the worst Pokemon. The, 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 literally the, the worst. Alright, let's see. I guess I'll just kill it with air cutter. So I should kill it. Alright, perfect. That's when he's at level. <laughs> he's just falling behind. <laughs> no. Oh, shit. Oh god, it's gonna take 10 years. We are totally in sync. Using our amazing connection, I will teach you all about rangers. I think this will be the last battle. We'll, we'll get up there and end the, the episode. I know all about being a ranger, right? You, you take your little Beyblade and you spin around the Pokemon and then they like you. I played Pokemon Ranger before, lady. I know what's up. Molga, so cute. 
Should I even have this thing out at the same time as Cosmo? No, but I'm gonna do it anyway. <laughs> Heart snap. Maybe that wasn't a good idea. <laughs> Maybe I should have sent out Jasper. Oh, it flinched. Actually, I'm going to switch to Jasper. I feel like Jasper's a better option for uh, dealing with an Emolga. Just, just in my opinion, anyway. We do have Rock Tomb. Oh, I forget. It likes to set up like this. I think I use one of these in my Nuzlocks, at, um, like in a, in a past one, not for like a recording or anything. I gave it acrobatics. It was good. Uh, acrobatics, spark, double team, and then I used the uh, pursuit. That was that was a pretty good combination of moves for what she can learn. Why well, did avoid the attack? I didn't like that. <laughs> Yeah, I did not know Amoga can learn acrobatics until it just asked if I wanted it. I'm like, oh, okay. I don't get why people say this is a crappy uh, poke, a crappy Pikachu clone. I happen to like Amoga. I would use one on my team, but um, I can't. I already have a flying type. Maybe if I do a Pokemon Black Two uh, Nuzlocke, maybe I'll put one on my team. But that is not the- this is not the- this is the game. <laughs> oh, I should've just crunched it. I should've killed it, but it's okay. I gotta go for the overkill on this one. Did I have two Pokemon? It did, didn't it? Yeah, it did. I totally had two Pokemon. Level 30 for Cosmo, though. Cosmo just <laughs> needs it. A Deerling. I'm going to just crunch it. That should kill it, right? Plus attack, crunch. I believe this is stab? I don't know. I don't know how they do this stuff. Why does Deerling always live through my moves? That's not very fair. Jump kick. <laughs> that did so much damage. It's not very fair. <laughs> Jasper's fine though. Jasper is doing all right. Actually, she's more than all right. She she didn't even feel that. Oh, good. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. We're done. In fact, we learned all about you. That was not. You guys got to get your money up. Bianca just gave me like five times that amount. You know much about this berry? Cherry berry? Isn't that paralysis? Listen carefully. You may hear the sound of breathing Pokemon and plants. Oh, that's nice. I'm gonna just stop right here. Alright. So, let me move the mic closer so you guys can hear me. <laughs> so, we did the Driftfield City Gym. We won, and now we've been requested to meet him at the Charged Stone Cave entrance for him to give us this TM that he's been uh, holding out on us. And then we bow Bianca and won. So, in the next one, we'll get through this route and see what Clay wants to show us. And hopefully, we'll get a new party member. But my name is Phoenix, and thank you guys for joining me on this adventure. I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye!